we have our next showcase match, another match to get everybody on the card. Street Profits, Viking Raiders, Alpha Academy, and Ricochet and Braun Strowman. I would like to see this match be a number one contenders match for the next tag team champions, which will be KO and Sami Zayn, which I think this will eventually lead into maybe backlash. I think it's time for the Street Profits to turn heel. I would like to see them in a new Hurt business potentially, but if not, maybe let's start pushing Montez as a single, but also push Angelo Jawkins as well. Maybe if you want to split him up during the draft. Montez could be a Money in the Bank potential winner, King of the Ring winner, maybe get to a final, the King of the Ring winner, be that strong, underdog babyface, come close and really have that big push and maybe be one of the early predictions to possibly be a finalist in the Royal Rumble next year, maybe Final Four. Doesn't have to win it, but maybe be in the Final Four, maybe a U.S. championship by the end of the year or heading into WrestleMania next year. Viking Raiders really haven't done much since they've been back. Kind of one of the failed projects of Triple H revitalizing them. It was kind of done with Vince McMahon, so kind of put this on Vince McMahon. And the Alpha Academy deserve better. I would like to see them maybe in a nice tag team program for the titles, maybe even win them. But Otis will be with Maximum Male Miles. I'm sure we'll see Maxine Dupree interfere and cost them. And I could see Chad Gable possibly being a guy who should be pushed for the IC title. Chad Gable and Goon. Let's see Chad Gable against Theory for the U.S. title. Put him in the U.S. title program. Maybe have him win the U.S. title. Push him as that new Kurt Angle. But I'm going with Braun Strowman and Ricochet. This team is kind of growing on me. They don't really have much going on for either one. Ricochet's fantastic. We'd love to see him maybe in a program with Logan Paul eventually. And Braun Strowman, <laughs> he's just a big guy with no direction right now, honestly, as well. So you pair them together. They're liked by the crowd. They have some nice tandem offense. I think they're getting better. It's something to run with. You got the big powerhouse and you got the small athletic high flyer. I think Braun Strowman and Ricochet continue their momentum, remain undefeated as a team, and I think they go on to face KO and Sami Zayn, which should be a fun tag team title program hitting in the backlash. Profits, we'll see what happens. Viking Raiders, we'll see what happens with them, as well as Alpha Academy. Let me know who you have winning.